Hey guys, we are going to make another card with Easter, of course. So we are going to create something very special. And I decided to have a squares today. But it's going to be easy and simple as well, using the same stamp set that I have. So I've already uh, had this red uh, card and I've pre-cut the um, panel, which is white panel with three squares. And I left the space to fit my Happy Easter. So the Happy Easter is going to go over here. So I measure it and I've already did it. I've also did the bunny rabbit and the chickens. So I've got this over here, all in my little box. <clears throat> I'm going to have some of those bunnies and those bunnies. And I need to check if I have any more. Nope. So I'm going to get this one and another this one. Yeah, I think that's it. And I've got a couple of butterflies here. So maybe if I decide, I'm going to add some butterflies. But not at the moment. So one of the first things I gotta do is just, I'm going to have uh, this panel over here. And I have to cut this panel all the way over here. It's going to be 3D, so it's going to be sticking out. I need to chop this one off and this is going to be red. So everything is going to stand out. All right, now this is going to go on the side. My little bunny rabbits as well and everything else. So this is my panel and I'm going to measure how much I need for this one. Okay, that's going to be easy because I don't need to measure too much going to just chop it off this way. Mm -hmm. There you go. That's done. And this should fit easily over here. Now, because I have the same square over here, this one is definitely much bigger. Uh, what I'm going to do is just measure up. Measure up. And chop. I can use my trimmer but it's going to take a little bit longer than that and the panel is ready to go over here so I have my 3d font tape and I would like to add all those decorations and all those things with a 3D form, so I'm going to go and add all the way around it. Yep. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Mm -hmm. That's too long, so I'm going to chop this one off. And this one is going to go all the way in the middle too. Chop. Stick them over here. Now, the one thing I have to remember is I can't put anything over here yet, 3D form, because if I want to have my Happy Easter sign, I need to first stamp it. Um, because if I don't stamp it, it's going to be too wonky and too wibbly to stamp it later. So it's not going to be even. The surface is not going to be flat. That's why I'm going to do it right now. It's going to be Happy Easter. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I can continue. So this one is going to go all the way here. This one is going to be here. And the red one will be in the middle. Well, that's the plan at least. 
I have not figured out yet how I'm going to design all those bunnies, but as long as my sentiment is there, I can continue with cutting the foam. I'm not putting any foam on the sides, only because I want to cover the little bunnies later. So now I need one here, one here and one here. So I need about three pieces. Three pieces. Okay, so I've added the pieces. I've added the pieces. The pieces are here already. So now I'm going to take the backing off. Okay, it's my rubbish bin. And I have to remember which one. So the bottom one will be purple. These are, those papers are my scraps. So all those papers come from my scrap. I need to make sure. Where are you going? That. Oh, this one will be just fine. Okay, so I did this one. It's covered. Now all I gotta do is just cover the top. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to do a shaker card today because that's not my point. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay, so I've got those two panels ready to go. And now I'm just going to add some liquid glue because it's kind of flat. I'm not going to add any more. It's going to be just liquid glue. I already have some stickiness here and here. All I'm going to add is just a tiny bit of glue on the sides. So it's going to stick to the card. Open the cover. And now I can easily position this one here. Mm -hmm. No. Super. Okay. So this card is almost ready. It looks really pretty. Now my bunnies. So where I'm going to put my bunnies? One bunny I would like to go over here inside. And another bunny I would like to go all the way inside here. And those two, this one is going to go here. Don't worry about sticking it. And this one, or oh, actually this one can go here because it's pretty cool. And I can add ears this way. Hmm. This one I can stick all the way over here uh -huh. now you understand why i haven't got too much and i've already had a couple of eggs so i can either add some eggs here and that's going to be my pretty cut yellow yellow would be good because i have some yellow here we go yellow card yellow eggs super now it's only the assembly that is required. I'm going to use the glue. If you want, you can use 3D foam again and you can pop them out. But I'm, I'm really happy to, to just add glue. If you want, you can create shaker cards with it. Shaker cards are good as well. Okay, a little bit of glue, and then this one goes all the way over here. Mm -hmm. It's my eggs, and now if I haven't decided exactly how I'm going to point out those two, but I think I'm happy with this location, and then eggs over here. And maybe a couple of eggs over here as well. So all I gotta do is just chop this one. Sorry, bunny. 
no offense nothing to do with you it's just you don't fit in my profile <laughs> this card requires a double-sided tape because it's pearlescent and my glue does not stick to the pearlescent cards so i'm going to open my red card red tape and i'm going to stick stick the banner with the red tape that's very okay so a couple of bits yeah i like this red tape i really do okay so i've put some glue some double-sided tape mm -hmm. okay and now this goes out and now i'm going to try to put this banner over here hopping along yeah now because this is a plain card i can put the ears i can leave the ears sticking out but because i'm sending it to a friend with children i know they're going to touch everything so the more things are attached the better it's still going to pop up don't worry now this one is going to go all the way over here being all happy and joyful there you go yeah so i have to chop this bunny that side sorry bunny no offense but i need to chop you off if you have um if you have some scrap papers then you can always stamp those on the scrap paper so you don't waste any paper and then color them in but i've already pre-cut them a couple of times i was watching some movies and then i pre-cut them mm -hmm. let me just open that one double-sided and another double sided. There you go. Mm -hmm. Doesn't want to go. Here you come. Now it's ready. So I am going to stick this banner all the way over here. Where are my eggs? These are my little eggs. Those eggs are already done before, so the, those eggs have been pre cut already. Okay, so one egg is going to go all the way over here, and the next egg, where's my red egg? Over here. The next red egg is going to go all the way over here. And I still have a couple of eggs left. The ones that I've pre-cut, so I can either put them here, another one over here. Hmm. And maybe one all the way to the top. Oh, this one I don't like. Hmm. What do you think, guys? I like it goes over here this will stick i'm going to attach this one later on as well so these this is my card for today you can make lots of those cards how much you want just keep making them um and i've been only using this uh, stamp set because that's the stamp set i have i am going to post a couple of more uh, videos about how i um, use other things to create other stuff i've already purchased a new magazine all the magazines that i have there are uh, they are my decisions so i don't get any commission from them i just like them because i like them okay now it's all done i'm happy and this is the card for today so it's all all prepared here you go that's my bunny uh, and as you can see, there's 3D. You can't see too much sticking out the bump. Oh, have not attached this one. 
it's okay i can do it always later um, if you want you can add a panel you can always add the panels i'm going to show i haven't had any glitters because i i'm not fan of glitters for some reason and the card is itself the red card is pearlescent so it's got some shimmer to it and i love those bunnies they are very cute smiley bunnies they are really adorable i hope you like this card please subscribe Click the bell for notification so you can see when I upload the next video. And I hope to see you soon. Bye!